I can tell you this man tried to save our country single-handedly on January 5th and 6th when he advised the administration, who was still the President of the United States, that they didn't have to do what happened on January 6th. Mm -hmm. That man right there tried to save our country. Justice Gableman's report is, I think, one of the most significant developments in the last year and a half as we're looking at this. Mm -hmm. It identified by chapter and verse a number of state statutes that were violated. And the consequences of those illegalities um, are tenfold or fifteenfold greater than the margin of victory in Wisconsin. We're talking about a federal election for presidential electors where under Article 2, Section 1 of the federal constitution, the sole authority for directing the manner of choosing electors belongs to the legislature. Amen. Amen. That authority is exercised by the legislature without any constraint from state law mm -hmm. or from state constitutions, including the constraint that says they have to go to the governor to ask permission. Mm -hmm. Now, the Wisconsin legislature, therefore, in my view, not just up until January 6th or inauguration, but today as well, mm -hmm. has the ability to look at the assessment and say, you know, our election was illegally certified. Mm -hmm. The consequences of that, we can fight about. 